I'm here at the LTE North America conference with Fergal Lawler of Alpha Wireless. Um, tell me what you're showcasing here. Okay, Joey, we're here with our latest uh, four-foot beam forming antenna. So it's got eight ports and allows you to steer the, the beam between plus or minus 30 degrees. It's a very popular product now in the US. This is designed for band 41 for one of the US operators. That along with uh, uh, our new range of small style antennas. That, uh, so we're covering all the frequency bands here, 1710 right up to 2690. And we've got options with integrated GPS, which is um, where we house the GPS in the top here to save putting an external device onto the pole trying to keep the component countdown on the, on the installations. Over on this side, we have a number of other products that are coming out. We have a dual bands here covering 2.5, 3.5. Again, one of the first to markets with these type of products. And then right on top is another small cell antenna where you're looking at uh, two, two by two MIMO in, a, in, a, in an Omni antenna. So these are all designed for the kind of small cell um, deployments. Probably looking to start next year in, 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 in high volume. And small cell is huge. It's it's yeah. growing yeah. exponentially, right? Yes. And, uh, so how do how do you guys differentiate yourself from the other yeah. small cell carriers? So one of the one of the key things Alpha does, we work very close with our customers to understand the requirements. This small cell antenna that we've designed up here, we work very close with a, one of our equipment vendors where we integrate a small cell antenna onto their radio. So that allows them again. This is sold in tens of thousands in 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 Asia, and you know that's all about keeping costs down on that particular model. These ones here, there's kind of more um, more features involved in these. Like we've got the the broad bandwidth, we've got internal diplexes where we can do two or four ports depending on the number of radios being used. So it's all about um, trying to get a, a product that fits the customer's needs, and that's. Yeah, it's working really good for us in the last number of years.